North Korea claims they invented the burrito. It's a very wild claim. North Korea has insanely claimed that Kim Jong-un's father invented burritos in 2011. (laughs) So burritos have only been around since 2011, guys. Did you know they came from North Korea? No clue. Had no idea. Did you guys invent guac as well? Oh, I want to go to North Korea now. It says despite food shortages in North Korea, burritos sales are booming after they made this announcement. Gee, I wonder... What's behind this propaganda? Gee, trying to sell some burritos? <laughs> I love it. They live in a world that they could just say that they did this. <laughs> Hilarious. And then they cut them off from the internet, and so no, no one really knows. Poor North Koreans are like, oh my goodness, these burritos. Well, at least they get burritos over there. That's pretty cool. So here's the, I, it seems to me that uh, if we're going to use this as a, as a case, uh, oftentimes I'd imagine North Korea won't adopt foreign or, you know, other cultures or cultural items or behaviors or foods but if they're going to they're going to claim that they invented it <laughs> so they imported burritos they're like yeah we invented burritos <laughs> they imported the crepe they're like yeah we invented crepes yep yeah, we invented cigars back in 2011 as well we invented cigars <laughs> this is hilarious i feel bad I feel so bad for these people the regime's propaganda mouthpiece said that the late Kim Jong-il dreamed up this Tex-Mex dish called the burrito back in 2001, shortly before his death from a massive heart attack. In fact, on his deathbed, he was like, I have a, I have a vision, one last vision before I go. Just get a, you could get a flour or a corn tortilla, just wrap it up in a sort of like a very small pouch, include some rice beans and a meat of your choice in there. Peppers, onions, possibly corn. If you want to get crazy, guac and sour cream would be very good too. Oh, we we, we must first invent guac, though. Oh, this is my vision <laughs> for my country. <laughs> you invented the burrito. What a bunch of dumbasses, man. The wild claim follows an equally insane propaganda story that alleged Kim Jong-il invented a dish called double bread with meat, which was sort of like a hamburger. <laughs> you invented the hamburger. <laughs> I'm just covering today two just outlandish cultures. They're just they're just so ridiculous. Um, it makes you glad that you're not in any of these places. Am I right, guys? Uh, it says here uh, the media claims that Kim Jong Il's fat tyrant son Kim Jong Un is following in the footsteps of his father by taking a meticulous interest in this dish called the burrito. Yeah, I'm sure he is. He looks like he would enjoy a burrito, or many. (laughs) And um, maybe next month he'll invent the quesadilla. You guys might get a quesadilla. North Koreans can be seen in this media footage devouring burritos at a street stand outside a food factory in the capital, Pyongyang. The video also shows a mural of Kim Jong-il grinning in a kitchen where burritos were being prepared. <laughs> I love how they just decided to make a... We're going we're gonna to commemorate this event by painting a mural of Kim Jong-il rolling the first burrito back in 2011. <laughs> Coincidentally, same year that he invented the football. Here's a mural of him kicking it through a gold post. <laughs> just so stupid. I mean, where's it going to end, guys? They're going to make the wild claim that, oh, also my father invented the hand job. Yes, we'll be unveiling a mural celebrating the invention of the handy in 2007 when he happened to be bored in a movie theater. 